Hello and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of Republic. Do you do you have the cure, Upworlder? Have you come to save us from the horrible fate of the others? Don't worry, I'm here to help you. You you'll help us? Oh, bless you, Upworlder, bless you. But you must hurry. We have the rat ghoul disease. It is only a matter of time until we are transformed into terrible creatures like those who attacked you when you first came into the pen. It is too late for them. Soon it will be too late for us, and we will transform into those horrible rat ghouls ourselves. Don't worry, I'll be back when I find a cure for you. Please hurry, Upworlder. We don't have much time until the transformation. Don't forget about us, Upworlder. If you find any way to cure this disease, please come back and help us. Don't worry, I will. It's in my nature. Oh, did you get out of my way, Karth? Oh my god. Alright. Wait. Wait. Back again. Healer. Is there something else you need? I need healing. Cool. Since I am apparently extremely weak for some unknown reason, it's alright. Let's take a look at the map. Now... Okay, we need to look for Rukil's Apprentice. The Rack Ghoul Serum. And for... Uh... Mission. Not a mission, mission. Keep going. I'm holding a melee weapon because basically I'm gonna be fighting up and personal with these fools for a little while. Unfortunately. I don't know what I'm excited to talk about closing gates and stuff. I don't even close the gate. Alright. So there's an entrance apparently to the northeast and to the northwest. Let's check them both out before we go in. Please, you have to help me. Nobody else is gonna help me. Even the Bex won't help. That was easy. Me. But I can't just leave him there. He's my friend. You'll help me, won't you? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Slow down, Mission. What's wrong? It's Zalbar. He's in trouble. Big trouble. We have to help him. If we don't, they'll sell him into slavery. Calm down, Mission. Take a deep breath and tell me what happened. Me, me, and Zalbar. We were just wandering around here in the Undercity. You know, looking for stuff we could find, just kind of exploring. We do it all the time. I guess with a Wookiee at your side, you've got to figure you can handle the odd rat ghoul attack. Only this time, they were waiting for us. Gamorian slave hunters. We didn't even have a chance to run. Big Z threw himself at him and then roared for me to run. I, I took off. I figured Zalbar would be right behind me. But there were too many of them. He couldn't get away. They're going to sell him to a slaver, I just know it. Do you know where they took him? I don't know for sure, but those Gamorians like to hang out in the sewers. The stink reminds them of home, I guess. That's probably where they took Big Z. I'll help you. If I help you get Zalbar back, you'll have to help me inside the Volker base. It's a deal. As soon as we get Big Z back, I'll show you a way into that Volker base. Now come on! We have to find Zalbar before they sell him to slavers, or worse! Do you know where he's being kept? The Gamorians make their camps in the sewers. I bet that's where we'll find Zalbar. And that's where I'll show you the secret entrance into the Volker compound. Mission has joined your party. Left click this response to go to party selection screen. Bam. She like just teleported. Okay, so mission's now on our what? team. And we'll level her up. Because apparently she needs to be leveled up. Yes, auto level up, that's fine. What has she got on her? Clothes, apparently. That's a good first step. Stealth field generator. Let's give her a combat suit. We've all got matching combat suits, except for me. I've got Republic Mod armor. Because I'm the boss, and I get what I want. We'll just give her one blaster for now. It's fine. What? He's got two. Yeah? What? And I've got one. What? 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 Exactly. 
Ooh, a frag mine. Um, trying to recover it. Try and disarm it then. That worked. Try and disable the mine. Actually, I got an idea. Don't step on it. Help. Help me. Please. I, I can feel it inside my skin. Something growing. Like some kind of hideous disease. Wait here. I'll see if I can find someone to help you. No! No! I can see it! Ah! Oh god. I got an idea. Run. Yeah. Nope, you didn't run. You didn't take the advice. You guys are idiots. Well, I'm glad you guys did it for me, but now you guys need healing. Yeah? Now I gotta heal you all. Here's what few med packs I have left. Got a lot of health. Sure. Right. What's this? It's a land, it's a thing, thingy thing. Republic uh, pod. Must be bastards. Good, right? So this seems to be the only information we got on it. So, oh my god. Let me out of here. I think it's the other guy. Just another view of the pod. Weird. Alright, so there's a... Oh wait, there might be... I don't see an entrance anywhere. The entrance to the thing. They said to the, there it is, yeah. Escape pod. There's something important about it, but I don't know what it is. Rubble. All right. Sweet. Here's the entrance to the sewers, all right. There's some people over here. What the heck is that? Don't, don't move. I'm, I'm not afraid to use this blaster if I have to. Settle down, kid. We've already lost enough men to those damn rat ghouls. The last thing we need now is more casualties from a needless firefight. Mm. By the looks of you, I'd say you're down here for the same reason we are. To salvage something from those downed Republic space pods. Let me give you some advice. Forget about it. Do yourself a favor and just head back from where you came. Who are you? That's Candorous Ordo. He's the most famous Mandalorian mercenary in this sector of the galaxy. This isn't a good place to stand around chatting. The Undercity is crawling with rat ghouls. I've already lost a half a dozen men to those monsters. Candrus, I heard something. Over there, in the shadows. Sounded like a rat ghoul. Yeah, it sounded like two. Sound three. 
Four. Looks like we've got company. Get those blasters ready, boys. Let's just sit there and watch. That's... I told Davik this salvage mission was a bad idea. His men aren't trained for this kind of thing, and I can't babysit them all. Okay, boys. We're getting out of here before I lose anyone else. I can't carry all this salvage back by myself. You'd be smart to get out of here as well. Even if you can handle the rat ghouls, I doubt there's anything worth finding anymore. What do you mean by that? Davik sent me down here with this motley crew to scavenge whatever we could from the Republic escape pods that crashed during the recent battle overhead. But the lower city gangs got here first. Anything worthwhile in those Republic pods is probably in their hands by now. Davik won't like that. Can you tell me about Davik? What are you, an off-worlder? Everyone knows Davik. He's a member of the Exchange. You know, the Interstellar Crime Syndicate. Smuggling, gambling, extortion... Davik controls it all here on Taurus. That's why I'm working for him. But lately, the lower city gangs have been giving my boss some trouble. Trouble? Did you say this trouble? This isn't really the best place to have these kinds of conversations. But I guess I could spare a couple of seconds for you. After all, you did help us out with those rat ghouls. The lower city is overrun with gangs. But the two most important ones are the Hidden Bex and the Black Vulkers. Used to be the Bex were the big dog and kept the others in line. But lately, the Black Vulkers are moving in on Beck turf and challenging them for control. The Vulkers are even starting to defy Davik. Take these escape pods, for example. Everyone knew Davik would want first crack at them. But I know for a fact those damn Vulkers have already sent their own salvage party down here. I better be going now. Come on, boys. Let's move out. He's almost dead. Boy, you mean. There's like no one left. But, oh, remains. Seven credits. What kind of person only really carries seven credits? Oh, God. More records. Let's move. Land Apprentice Journal Antidote Kit. Found the journal of Rukil's apprentice near her corpse. You should return it to the old man in the village, in the outcast village, to tell him of her fate and deliver the journal to him. Alright. It's over here. There's a mine over there. Corpse. Med pack, ten credits. Skeletal corpse. Med pack, seven credits. Okay. Disable mine. This looks to be another entrance. Or not. That was another entrance to the thingy me jigger. But I guess there's an in no, that's the elevator. 
Where's the other entrance? Well, it must be that way. Let's head back that way. Here's that entrance here. There's another one. Let's go talk to Rukil and deliver this journal to him. Greetings once more, Upworlder. Do you bring news of my apprentice? Have you discovered her fate and proved yourself to be a true savior of my people? Your apprentice is dead. I have her journal. It is as I feared, then. She joins the list of those who have given their lives in the service of our cause. But though I am saddened by this news, there is yet hope. By finding my apprentice, you have proved yourself worthy, Upworlder. You are to be the beacon on our path to salvation. You will guide us to the promised land. Guide you? I don't even know what the promised land is. You are marked, Upworlder. Even my dim old eyes can see the mantle of destiny that cloaks you. Perhaps old Rukil knows you better than you know yourself. I am old. I have lived a hundred years in the Undercity, cast down into the darkness. I know the legends and history of our people, and now you must learn it too. Very well, tell me the history of your people. The great city of Taris covers the entire surface of this planet. There is no land to grow food. Kelp harvests and the creatures of the sea are our only food source. A century ago, rising levels of toxic pollution poisoned the oceans and famine swept the planet. The rich hoarded food for their own use, and the poor were left to starve and die. From what I've seen of Terrace, it doesn't look like much has changed. Except for the upper city, people here are just as bad off as the poor in your little history. But the poor rose up against this tyranny, and civil war engulfed the planet. Millions died in the fighting, and huge sections of Taurus were destroyed or abandoned. The rebellion was crushed in the end. Thousands were taken prisoner. The jails could not hold them all, and so the practice of banishing all prisoners to the Undercity was born. Is that how you came to be out here? Many brave men and women were banished here to the Undercity for their part in the rebellion. People like my father and grandfather were cast down, along with their families. What did you expect? If they could get away with it, the Teresian nobles would stuff their own mothers down here to make more room in the upper city. Now we live a dark existence beneath the streets of Terrace. A life devoid of all hope but one. The Promised Land. And you will be the one to show us the way to get there. Promised man Land? What's that? Legends tell of a self-sufficient colony founded just before the famine and lost during the Civil War. A paradise beneath the Undercity, where droid servants tend to every knee. For many years, I searched for the Promised Land, just as my grandfather and father did before me. When I became old and gray, my apprentice continued the search on my behalf. Sounds like a myth to me. Something to give the people here some false hope to cling to so they don't go mad with despair. I have collected many clues hinting at its location. The journal of my apprentice provides yet more information. But still, there are too many pieces missing from this puzzle. But I know my father and grandfather each had journals where they recorded their own discoveries. Perhaps with their journals, I could at last uncover its hidden location. Good plan, but... I don't know, it just seems a bit... Risky. I have one. Yes, Upworlder. Well done. How 
However, I see that this journal alone does not have enough clues for me to solve this mystery. Too many pieces are still missing. I'm afraid that only with all three journals, my grandfather's, my father's, and my apprentice's, will I be able to discover the location of the Promised Land. I will leave this journal with you for safekeeping for now. Perhaps it will aid you in your search for the others. I wish you luck, Upworlder, for the sake of the entire village. Level up. Let's go. Skills recommended. Okay. Feats. I've got sneak attacks two, three, or whatever. Ah. Uh, Proof critical strike. Stunned for six seconds unless they make a fortitude save. Eight stunned for six seconds. Defense lowers by five. Master considerable mainly only empathy. Rapid shot critic improved sniper strike. Melee weapons toughness. Dueling. Improve to weapon fighting. Let's, let's do armor proficiency medium. Just in case. I can wear heavier armor just in case I need to. Not heavy, heavy armor, but improved armor. Alright, that is it for this episode of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And that I can't actually do that because my mouse will be like over here. Well, over, oh well. Thank you so much for watching this episode of uh, Kotor. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I did. And uh, like this if you did enjoy it as much as I did. Subscribe for more awesome content done by me. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.